too. I'm uh, off to a little later start. I had to get some rest last night. I was definitely a little sleep deprived, but uh, sun might be poking out this afternoon. I hope I'm not too late to the party, but I guess we'll see how many machines are there today and we'll be there in a little bit. Well, they said Saturdays are crazy. This whole lot is completely full and the lot up by the Welcome Center, that's uh, at least half full right now. So I'd say there's triple the people here, if not quadruple. All right, here we are, day two. These two guys I was parked next to, I was admiring their 250Rs. They said there's a 250R little meetup going on right now to get a picture out in the dunes at 2.30. So I'm actually gonna follow them. They said, hey, why don't you follow us out? And hopefully I get to see a bunch of awesome machines all lined up on the hill here. That'd be pretty cool. It's a very wide array of vehicles here. There's a lot of trucks and some really high performance looking sand rails and buggies today. I'm excited to see everything running out here. more vehicles out here. We couldn't even ride these hills yesterday because the wind was just, all it would do is shoot sand in your face. On that 250R. I think he said it's completely stocked too. He said it's been their family since new. Oh, he's bucking. He's bucking. Oh. This guy's scooting along just fine. Where is he going to go? What's your name, by the way? Chris. I'm Pete. Hey, yeah, nice to meet you. My brother's yeah. name is Chris. Pete Haggard. Yep. We'll you got, dude, you were freaking, you were dancing over there. Full commitment or, yeah. or back off? Right, you know? I backed off. Yeah, well, I was worried for a sec. I was like, oh God, oh God, there he goes. Cause I got a microphone in here, so I commentate everything. <laughs> I'm gonna go in here and walk, I'll walk through all these. Yeah. Man, this every 250R is so cool. Could even pick a favorite if I wanted to. Wow. Hey, I recognize you. Dude, this is so cool. I'm here for a Raptor rally, but I'm filming 250Rs. Wow. that's owned by the guy that organized the event. I don't want to pick favorites, but this orange one, oh my God. I'm like the 250R stalker right now. You're like me. I'm not doing that. Well, I don't have the right four-wheeler. 
<laughs> There's that sunshine poking out. Perfect time for that guy's photo too. Dude, it's super clean. There's not a scratch on that thing. Oh, it's a different place when the sun's out. The sand looks really nice. Ooh, that lake breeze feels really good. It's actually kind of nice to just cruise around this place. It's definitely a lot of people watching and observing. Wow, it's just truck heaven. So many awesome single cabs just everywhere. If it's got two doors, I'm all over it. There's a bunch of Raptors. Maybe I should stop by those Raptors. really well like I'm assuming even though it evolves with the wind I guess maybe through the sand hills you could follow me but through the whoops I could follow you because you're gonna be a little more capable than me well, I'm behind a subscriber right now his name is Tyler he's a local guy so hopefully he doesn't dust me too bad out all these single cab trucks. Look at those Chevys. Ride a four wheeler. Hey, what's up? How's it going? Where's the rally at? Uh, there's a bunch of guys that are lined up over on the hill by the where all the drag racing is going on. There's a bunch of built Raptors over there. Okay. Yeah, so it's been pretty cool. This place is just nuts today compared to yesterday. I just know that you kind of have an idea what's on the other sides of these, right? Yep. And I know some spots are longer and steeper than others. So when I get to the top, I go slow because I don't know what to expect.
jump on a ball. like crazy. Woo! Do you want to go on top of the hill for a little bit? I, I, I wouldn't mind filming from this angle. Perfect. Oh, that's a good idea, dude. Yeah, it was great to meet you, man. This was super fun. You can rip the whoops, dude. Dude, all of a sudden you were gone. You were on the corner. I couldn't even see you. No, super fun, man. I will be back to this state. We'll see you later. Well, this is going to be my last pass through at Silver Lake here. It was a lot of fun. I'm just blown away by the amount of vehicles in here, the diverse toys. Everybody's got their own style and expression with their machines. And man, it's definitely, it was cool to see everything. It's kind of nuts to be uh, on display for everybody when you're going up this hill. It's not the biggest place, but it's always better than nothing. Silver Lake. The tires stayed underneath me. Really no close calls. It was a good safe place to ride. I'm very grateful to everybody that met up with me. People that saw me and said hi. I mean it's just so exciting to see the enthusiasm for these videos and what I've been doing. So I just really appreciate it. Thank you guys very much. Well I'm all loaded up. Day two Silver Lake's in the books. Uh, after riding with Tyler, I actually went over and talked to some of the guys that were drag racing that were part of the Raptor Rally, and I, I only met a few of them here, but it turns out that they're having their own little private drag racing event tonight, and they invited me along to come share it, so I'm actually going to head straight there right now, and uh, this video is going to probably end after this, but the next video will have some Raptor Rally sand drags on private property, and they said there's even a timing tree and everything, so I'll be there in a little bit, and I'm super excited to see the machines and to meet you guys and to share everything with everybody. So as always, thank you for watching and we'll catch you guys next time.